Hi, I'm Rabbi Ari here at Temple Shalom in New Milford, Connecticut, and let me tell you what we've got going on this week. Um, I have my adult Hebrew class this Monday afternoon at uh, 4 o'clock. Uh, Tuesday, starting at 9 in the morning, I have my out-of-the-office office hours at the Java House on Bank Street across from the movie theater. Uh, and then I'm going to be out of town on uh, Thursday through the weekend, um, so if it's an emergency. You can always call me anytime or leave a message at the office. Um, but in the meantime, uh, Barbara Kessler will be leading services on Friday night at 6.30. We will have our Torah study group at 9.30 a.m. Saturday morning, followed by services led by Cantor Laura on Saturday at 10.30 a.m. Uh, there's just a few uh, upcoming events I'd like to draw to your attention. On uh, Saturday night, uh, they'll be showing a movie, a documentary about David Ben-Gurion in uh, celebration of Israel's 70th anniversary, and uh, we encourage people to attend that. I'm sorry I can't make it, but um, I do know a number of people who will be going, and I think it's going to be a really, really great event. Uh, so, strongly encourage people to attend. Uh, we have a Padam Havdalah coming up June 30th for families with children six and younger, um, and then uh, in August, on August 4th, our own Ellen Lazarus has an art opening exhibit at the White Silo, uh, so we encourage people to attend that as well. There's a link below to my June bulletin, as well as uh, Friday night sermon, uh, Zero Tolerance for Child Abuse, um, that is available for you online, um, as well as a link to our Saturday morning services, and of course the link uh, so you can catch all of our services live if you like, or afterwards at any time. Uh, there are just a few mitzvah opportunities I would draw your attention to. One is uh, there is a uh, artisan clock auction at the JCC. Um, uh, David Marks is a phenomenal woodworker, and uh, he uh, designed and created this beautiful clock. And um, if you're interested in fine art, you might want to place a bid on this uh, wonderful uh, um, um, opportunity to uh, raise funds for the JCC. Um, also, um, those who are not aware, there are a number of uh, uh, students in uh, hundreds, really, uh, in the town of New Milford that cannot afford lunch, and they receive free lunches throughout the course of the year. Well, what happens to those students over the course of the summer when the school's no longer providing those lunches? Well, uh, we're grateful uh, to uh, Mayor Pete Bass for taking the initiative to work collaboratively with a number of institutions, uh, nonprofit and religious and secular, and working all together to try to provide uh, food for the kids. Um, and and uh, what we really need is some volunteers uh, to help out with the product. There's um, a link below. You can go to the link. There's a wish list on Amazon if you'd like to you know, contribute in a financial way. Uh, and uh, if you'd like to volunteer your time, it doesn't take a lot of skills to put granola bars in you know, paper bags or to be available while these uh, meals are distributed. Uh, but they already have, I think it's about 100 kids that have signed up for this program. It's a real need in this town. It's an easy easy way for you to do a big mitzvah, so we encourage people uh, to volunteer for that. There's a link below. Uh, wishing everyone a Shavuot Tov.